Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to another video on ForgottenWeapons.com. I'm Ian McCollum, and I'm here today at the James Julia Auction House, taking a look at some of the guns that they're going to be selling in their upcoming Spring of 2018 firearms auction. And I don't normally look at sporting shotguns, but this one really caught my eye. Now from back there, this, uh, from what you can see, it seems to be a pretty nice sporting shotgun. Silver, gold engraving, beautiful patterning to the wood. What's interesting about it is, if I flip it over this way, you can see light between the barrels. And that's not normal. Let's take a closer look at this. So here's the thing about double barrel shotguns. The barrels are not actually designed to be exactly parallel. Well, in normal guns they're not. In this one, they are. But typically, the two barrels, whether they're over, under, or side by side, are intended to be angled just slightly towards each other. So that two shot columns, you know, one fired from each barrel, will actually converge at a predetermined point, a predetermined range. Ellis Brothers, the manufacturers of this particular gun, instead opted to make those two barrels parallel. Um, I would suspect they had a, a specific customer uh, who requested that, and they went ahead and did it. That gap between the barrels looks really quite large, but I will maintain that that is actually exactly what you would get if you took a standard uh, set of double barrel 12 gauge, well, 12 gauge double barrels, and lined them up parallel. You don't believe me, do you? Well, here is on the right our parallel bore gun, and on the left another side by side double 12 gauge. And you can see that at the breech end, those are exactly the same size. And yet, when we come to the muzzles, you can see a very distinct difference. So you might think that everyone would want a gun like this with parallel bores, because, well, you'd always know exactly, your, your point of aim would always be exactly the same. With conventionally regulated barrels, your point of aim kind of changes. However, within actual practical usable distances, the barrel, the, the typical barrel regulation means that your point of aim actually, your, your two shot columns actually get closer and closer to each other until they converge at what is typically about a maximum range, usually something like 40 yards. And so shooting is actually simpler with well-regulated barrels than it would be with these parallel style, uh, unless you had a specific purpose in mind. Maybe, maybe long-range shooting. Um, it's difficult to say without knowing exactly who ordered this and, and hearing directly from them why they wanted it this way. But it certainly is a very nice uh, firearm. Made by the Ellis Brothers of Birmingham. Silver and gold embellishments, as well as some nice fine checkering on the fore end there. And the same on the action. Well, if you're into very fine sporting shotguns, uh, like to collect that sort of thing, but you want something a little bit different without sacrificing quality, this might be just the thing for you. Take a look at the description text below. You'll find a link there to the James Julia catalog page on this particular shotgun. Uh, and that'll give you their description, their pictures, their value estimate, and everything else you would need to uh, place a bid on it right through their website. Thanks for watching.